Hey guys, how's it going? So I recently switched over to Microsoft Edge Chromium based as my daily web browser of choice and honestly I've been loving it so far. Now Microsoft Edge is a great browser but if you're someone who has already switched to Edge or is planning to this video is for you because today I'll be talking about seven cool tips and tricks for Microsoft Edge that's based on Chromium that will really enhance your overall web browsing experience. This is Varun from Guiding Tech and let's get started. Okay, so let's kick things off with dark mode. Yes, Windows 10 has a dark mode option, but Edge, well, it sometimes does not switch to it by default. Don't worry, here's how to change it. You can just go to browser settings, appearance, theme, and choose from system default, light, or the dark theme. And voila, that's it. Okay, so now obviously since this is Microsoft Edge browser, the default search engine here will be Bing. Don't worry, you can change that quite easily as well. Just open settings, head over to privacy and services, scroll down to the address bar and set Google as your search engine used in the address bar. Or if you're too concerned about your privacy, you can even opt for DuckDuckGo. Now Microsoft Edge provides quite a busy homepage. It offers Bing search bar, frequently visited sites, Bing images as background and Microsoft News integration at the bottom. However, you can change that to your liking. From the homepage, tap on the settings icon and choose from the focused, inspirational or informational view. Or better yet, you can even go for a custom layout to unleash your creativity. Now Edge also comes with Microsoft News that's integrated right on the home screen. But of course, you do not want to read everything, just the topics that concern you, right? Well, from the bottom menu, just tap on personalize and it will open the my interests menu. Select the relevant topics that interest you and remove the unnecessary ones. Okay, so here's an interesting one. Microsoft Edge comes with an excellent reading mode that removes ads and unnecessary clutter from the web page. So whenever you're visiting a web page, just tap on the reader icon in the address bar and the reading mode will provide a clean looking interface to read the posts. From here, you can change the font size, the style, the reading mode background, and even ask the system to read aloud the post. Another thing that you can do with Edge is that you can pin the most frequently visited web pages. Just right click on any tab and select the pin tab and it will be tucked away in the upper left corner. So whenever you open the browser, the tabs will load themselves and the web pages are already there ready for you. Lastly, this collections, which is Microsoft upping the game for bookmarks. You can create a collection of web pages and notes and give it a relevant title in the collections. Just tap on the collections icon, select start new collection, add a title and you're good to go with adding web pages and notes. This feature comes in super handy because instead of creating different folders of bookmarks where you can add separate bookmarks for a research purpose, you can just create a collection. This is great for students and even for journalists or any sort of productivity work involved where you have to do a lot of research. And with that, we come to the end of this video. Now, if you like this video and you feel that these tricks helped you, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more awesome tech content. Till then, this is Varun from Guiding Tech and I'll see you in the next one.